only on two, you never know what people are really about until you get to know them a little better. That's the case with Rose, a Tulsa security guard who's put raising a family and being a caretaker ahead of her talent. But as two works for you, Lisa Jones shows us here at 6 o'clock. Rose's work now has a prominent place alongside works from other international artists. Most everyone that comes through the door here at Bank of America Tower knows exactly who Rose is. But what they may not realize is what her true passion is. Hello. No one gets by the front today? desk without yeah. Rose the security guard okay. saying hello. Hey, Bill. Or helping with directions. Yes, go up on the eighth floor. Sitting and still is hard for her, so Rose keeps busy with what she loves most. For a couple hours, I'm kind of strapped to the desk, so I doodle. She's drawn since she was a little girl, but Rose's husband recently died after a battle with cancer. The friendly faces she sees every day at the front desk knew she was suffering during that time, and several asked her to draw and paint for them. We kind of gave her a distraction, something she could come back to that she used to do and love, and sort of escape the hardship when you're losing a loved one. Don Burdick offices in Rose's building. He's always appreciated original art long before he could afford it. Starting my job in Midland, Texas, what did I, I had a mattress on the floor, I bought a used piano and I bought two paintings from a starving artist. His collection has grown since then. Work from artists all around the world line the hallways of Don's office. Don had seen Rose doodling and made a special request in honor of his new company. He didn't expect what she came back with. He did a draft out of an elephant and colored it, handed it to him and asked him if that's what he wanted. It was, in fact, Rose's work now hangs center stage. Anything with animals in it, Don ordered up more of Rose's art. Ducks, groundhogs, and old family pets. I said, could you do like a horny toad uh, painting with little babies and have them eat an ants or something? And she goes, yeah. And she's just got her style about her with some bold oh, colors. That. Rose says painting is her medicine and the money she's made here and there help pay the medical bills. Because my husband had cancer, that's how I was paying for his chemo. Rosa's latest work, a series of angels with all of the money made going to help children fighting that same dreadful disease that took her husband. Lisa Jones, Two Works For You.